Hello friends and welcome to Encounter. I'm so thrilled that you're still joining me here on a Sunday afternoon or Sunday evening to sing and to worship and to end your weekend with your eyes fixed on God. What a privilege it is for me to lead times like this online even, but I know that you're there and I just pray that you're enjoying these sessions. Please do subscribe to the channel if you haven't and say hello in the comments. I'd love to connect with you there and see where you're joining from and how the session impacts you. Turn with me to Psalm 42 as we start today. And let's just start with verse 1, where the psalmist writes, As the deer pants for streams of water, so my soul pants for you, my God. Let's pray. Father, we come panting after you. We come longing for you, thirsting for you. And we know that you alone can quench our thirst. You alone can come and satisfy us. And so we appeal to you, O God, in the name of Jesus, please come. Please come, Holy Spirit, and pour yourself out. We thirst for you and long for you deeply. And we yield our spirits to you in this time. And so hear our words, hear our worship. And as we spend this time in your presence, bless us as we bless your name. For your name is strong and mighty, and it's the name in which we pray. Amen. So let's sing as the deer pants for the water.
Let's go back to Psalm 42. We'll read verse 1 again and then carry on. As the deer pants for streams of water, so my soul pants for you, my God. My soul thirsts for God, for the living God. Where can I go and meet with God? And then the psalmist seems to express his depression and his sadness. My tears have been my food day and night, while people say to me all day long, Where is your God? These things I remember as I pour out my soul, how I used to go to the house of God under the protection of the mighty one with shouts of joy and praise among the festive throng. I remember during COVID, this verse meant a lot to me. When we were all stuck at home, I would say, well, I remember how I used to go to church and enjoy worshiping there. At least these days we're allowed to do it again. He goes on, why, my soul, are you downcast? Why so disturbed? Within me, put your hope in God, for I will yet praise him, my Savior and my God. Do you relate? Maybe you're feeling downcast and disturbed deep within of late. Maybe you just need the peace of God to come and fill your heart. Maybe your soul is in need of some replenishing. The psalmist goes on, My soul is downcast within me, therefore I will remember you from the lands of the Jordan, the heights of Hermon from Mount Miser. And so now he, he seems as if he's on top of mountains. And he says, Deep calls to deep in the roar of your waterfalls. All your waves and breakers have swept over me. Deep calls to deep, the deepest part of the ocean, calling to the deepest part of the other ocean in praise of God. Friends, sing this next song with me. And as you do, come thirsty and come longing for his filling, but... Picture yourself in the waters, in the deep river of God, with, with his love and his breakers just washing over you and overwhelming you with love, with peace, with joy. All who are thirsty, all who are weak, come to the fountain, dip your heart in the stream of life, let the pain and the sorrow be washed away in the waves of His mercy. As deep cries out to deep, we sing, come Lord Jesus, come, come Lord Jesus, come, all who are thirsty, all who your heart in the stream of life. Let the pain and the sorrow be washed away in the waves of His mercy. As deep cries out to deep, we sing, come Lord Jesus.
call upon you, Lord. My spirit longs to touch you. And I feel you calling me. So I draw near. I'm reaching out my hand. I need the kiss of your presence And I feel you reach for me As I draw near Deep calls to deep As your glory surrounds me Break through to my heart River of God, deep calls to deep as I fall into worship. Flood my whole being with your deep river of God. River of God, I offer you my love as you love me so freely, and I'm laying down my life as I draw near. You have brought me to this place. By your grace and your mercy And I want to see your face As I draw near Deep calls to deep As your glory surrounds me Break through to my heart River of God, deep calls to deep as I fall into worship. Flood my whole being with yourself, deep river of God. Deep river of God Deep river of God Deep river of God Let's pray. Come Lord Jesus, come. Come, Holy Spirit, come. We need you. We're thirsting for you, Lord. Many of us, our souls are downcast and disturbed, and we've come here to put our hope in you. We've come here because we want to praise you, Lord, in spite of the difficulties of life. And yes, Lord, we've all known times of great joy in the, in the temples or in the churches where we've sung our shouts of praise and lifted you up among the people. But in quiet moments like this, deep down, many of us realize we're not doing okay. But deep calls to deep as we worship. And in the roar of your waterfalls, Lord, we feel you raining down on us again. Your waves and your breakers sweep over us, but don't, don't put us in danger. They, they bring us to a place of safety and rest. Thank you, Lord, that... Just as deep calls to deep in worship, we call to you in worship today and say how great, how wonderful, how mighty you are and what love, what love you have for us. And so thank you for quenching our thirst and drawing us closer into you. In this very moment, we feel that warmth of you all around us, drawing us deeper into your love, reminding us how great you are. Come and be with us as we continue, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. 
Let's continue in Psalm 42, which says this, Deep calls to deep in the roar of your waterfalls. All your waves and breakers have swept over me. And then verse 8, By day the Lord directs his love. At night his song is with me, a prayer to the God of my life. Do you know that all throughout today God has been directing his love to you? And is this night going to be a night where his song is with you? Can you picture God singing over you and just pouring out his love into you? God loves us so. How deep is the love of God? Deeper than the deepest sea and the deepest rivers. I I just think of that verse, deep calls to deep, which explains how, like I said, the deepest parts of the of the rivers or the oceans calling out in praise to each other. God's love is deeper even still. Do you know this deep love of God, friends? Do you know that even today, even in this moment, He is pouring out His love into your life? Can you hear His song being sung over you? Listen to this song, and may it be that you hear the Father's song singing over you. I have heard so many songs Listened to a thousand times There is one that sounds above them all The Father's song, the Father's love You sung it over me and for Eternity, it's written on my heart. It's heaven's perfect melody, the Creator's symphony. You are singing over me, Father's song. Heaven's perfect mystery The King of love has sent for me And now you're singing over me The Father's song I have heard so many songs Listen to a thousand times, but there is one that sounds above them all, sounds above them all. The Father's song, the Father's love, He sung it over me and for eternity, it's written on my heart. It's heaven's perfect melody The Creator's symphony Well, you are singing over me The Father's song Heaven's perfect mystery The King of love has sent for me Now you're singing over me The Father's song The Father's song The Father's love You sung it over me And for eternity It's written on my heart Well, even though the psalmist knows that God is singing over him, he still struggles, which is true for many of us. Look how the song continues in Psalm 42. By day the Lord directs his love, at night his song is with me, a prayer to the God of my life. I say to God, my rock, why have you forgotten me? Why must I go about mourning, oppressed by the enemy? My bones suffer mortal agony as my foes taunt me. 
saying to me all day long, where is your God? He's still struggling and everybody's still just mocking him because of his faith. And then this verse repeats, why, my soul, are you downcast? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise him, my Savior and my God. I will yet praise him. Oh, yes, I will yet praise him, even though there are all sorts of things going in my life that I wish weren't going, even though I feel downcast and disturbed and upset, even though I'm being taunted on all sides, I will yet praise him. That's why we gather online for things like this. That's why we go to church is to still praise him. Of course, you can do it by yourself anywhere, and we must be praising God everywhere and anywhere we go. But it's moments like this where we draw aside and alongside other people, Worship the God who is our hope that our souls are lifted. I hope that your soul is lifted as you've spent this time in worship tonight. And so one more song here. It's a song that Gavin and I recorded a few years ago now. But it says that God is sovereign. And so we trust him and we praise him. Think of this in terms of Psalm 42. Putting your hope in God and your trust in God, even when things don't seem to be going your way. Listen to these words, sing them, put your faith in him. Realize that all of your life is held in his hands. Sovereign in the mountain air, sovereign on the ocean floor, with me in the calm. With me in the storm, sovereign in my greatest joy, sovereign in my deepest cry. With me in the dark, with me at the dawn. In your everlasting arms, all the pieces of my life, from beginning to the end. I can trust you in your never failing love. You work everything for good. God, whatever comes my way, I will trust you. Sovereign in the mountain air, sovereign on the ocean floor, with me in the calm. With me in the storm, sovereign in my greatest joy, sovereign in my deepest cry. With me in the dark, with me at the door. In your everlasting arms, all the pieces of my life, from beginning to the end. I can trust you in your never-failing love. You work everything for good. God, whatever comes my way, I will trust you. All my hopes, all I need, held in your hands. All my life, all of me, held in your hands all my fears all my dreams held in your hands in your everlasting arms all the pieces of my life from beginning to the end I can trust you your never failing love you work everything for good god whatever comes my way i will trust you god whatever comes my way i will trust you god whatever comes my way i will trust you Lord, we praise you because you are sovereign over everything. 
We praise you because we trust you and we know that all of our lives are held in your hands. And so thank you, Lord, that even though our souls may be downcast and disturbed, our hope is in you and we will still praise you, our Savior and our God. Father, thank you for singing over us tonight as we've sung to you. Bless our souls. Give us peace and joy. And may your song be on our lips all through this week as we place our trust in you. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for joining me, friends. I hope that you've been blessed by this session. I'd appreciate your support. A lot of you are supporting my online work, and that goes a long way. Thank you very much. You can find out more about that at this link. God bless you guys. Take care. Much love to you all.